Zach Wilson had a rough spring, by all means. Back in April, the quarterback was traded from the New York Jets to the Denver Broncos, marking the end of a three-year stint that never produced a winning record, let alone a playoff appearance. Then his new team declined his fifth-year option. If there is any consolation, it is that he has his girlfriend Nicolette Delano. She recently went on vacation with some of her friends, which, according to the images she posted on her Instagram feed, involved visiting forests and dining out. Wilson left a one-word comment on his girlfriend's post. Hati. Wilson and Delano have been dating since 2022. In an interview with Deseret News in June 2023, Wilson confirmed he and Delano had been dating for a year or so. In the same interview, Wilson also revealed that she was actually a designer for Morgan & Co., a dress brand aimed at young women attending social dances, coming-of-age parties, and the like. She used to do some TikTok stuff for fun, but she is actually one of the top designers at this company called Morgan & Company they make dresses, like Mother of the Bride, and prom dresses. So she works in New York City and she gets to design dresses every day, which is a pretty cool gig. Analysts already see Zach Wilson struggling to break through with Broncos. Zach Wilson might have an uphill battle breaking through to get playing time on the Broncos this season amid stiff competition at QB. The Athletics Nick Kosmitter thinks that in a quarterback room that already has promising rookie Bo Nix and sometime starter Jarrett Stidham, Wilson figures to be the odd man out unless he shows massive improvements to his game. Wilson looks like someone who may need more time to adjust to Denver's offense, even more so than Nick's. Perhaps training camp could alter the equation, but at this point, it's hard to envision Wilson starting for Denver in Week 1. The Denver Post's Parker Gabriel, meanwhile, is only slightly more optimistic about Zach Wilson's chances, especially with the new rule that allows teams to have an emergency quarterback on their game-day rosters. Regardless of whether Bo Nix wins the job right away or not, he's, Wilson, obviously going to be on the roster. If there were a time to keep three quarterbacks, this could be it for Peyton, but he doesn't usually. Broncos practice resumes on July 17 for the rookies. Veterans will report beginning July 23. There will be a joint session with the Green Bay Packers on August 16.